Oh, Magnum PI everyone. He's at McDonald's. It's actually a pretty good looking car for an oldie. I don't know if it's a 328 or it's a GTS. What is that? Oh, it's a 300. Interesting. I like her. Oh, if you're wondering what I've been up to lately, it's uh, going blurry with my camera. No, I didn't paint it. Like, all over the place, but come on, focus. Yeah, I pretty much painted all this white and then the deck is coming next. And then uh, pretty much done, but this goes all around the house, uh, both sides. Paint the fence there, Daniel, Daniel's son. And just painting this thing, which has probably been in the family for like, I don't know, God knows, 50 years and it's like a total piece of crap. Bringing it back to life with uh, some old paint that I found out in the uh, shed there. Why not? It looked horrible before it was all just coming off and stuff, but uh, we'll give her a few coats, brand new. Oh, I see free stuff. Gotta go check it out, because you never know. It could be golden. Yes, dancer pants on a Saturday morning. Nice and early and cool. You gonna walk over here? Come on. I don't even have carrots with me, but you can see. Yes, your foot's looking a little bit better, bud. Yes, it is. Pretty good. All right. I apologize I did not bring any carrots. I'm sorry, man. Oh, I just went on and checked on Dancer. He's doing pretty good. Now it's time for, I don't know, a little Mickey D's. I haven't had Mickey D's in freaking years. Oh, that's weird. It's metal. What is that? There's a lady walking her horse. Oh, that's kind of freaky. I was outside. I was just clearing some blackberry bushes up on a ladder. And I freaking reached. They were actually up behind the wall. And I was reaching up behind there. And I reached right into a freaking wasp's nest. And the whole thing is like plumed out with wasps. And there were so many. One actually like bounced off my sunglass. I think I could see his butt coming right for me. Like right from my eyeball. And it bounced off my sunglasses. So thank God I was wearing these. Or I'd have a freaking stinger in my eyeball and I'd probably be in the hospital but anyways I did get some free stuff from uh, neighbor Nancy she gave me some stuff when she was going through clearing out her yard and I uh, have some of this wood stuff it's kind of you know old and I don't know it matches the house it matches the motif around here if you haven't noticed it's kind of you know rustic and cabiny but this is an old relic of a, a wood holder so I'm gonna clean that up I don't know if I'm actually gonna use it it just kind of looks cool but you know the price is fair it was free Kinda got some neat details and stuff. Same with this, and uh, I do have the other attachments. It just looks kind of bulky, so I just left the, the two in here for now. She just brought this over, and I guess it's like for cleaning hardwood. I guess it works like an iron. You just fill it up with water, and then wait for that button to go, and press the button, and steam clean your floors. So that'll be perfect for here, because everything is hardwood here. Not hardwood, but laminate, fake, whatever. And then these tiles around the stove, they need to be clean because, you know, birdies like to come in there and drop crap all over the place and make a mess. And, like, I did clean that up, but it's still kind of dirty. What else? What else? Oh, she gave me, like, an old uh, wine rack, too. Kind of rustic looking. And, uh, where is that? Yeah, right there. Oh, and this was a score fan it's an old fan and uh, this needs to be painted a little bit rusty but I took it all apart and I cleaned out all the dust inside of it and it works brand new like this thing just it's totally silent too and like all it needed was cleaning it was full of dog hair and dust in there it works great and it uses probably a lot less power than that big box fan back there so scores free stuff she also had a bunch of these and what they are is a USB cable plugs in your computer and like heats up your drink but it's also a USB four point hub. So I was thinking I could take that apart and use it for God knows what. Like build it into something else or just use the buttons and LEDs and the USB ports and the cable and that could come in handy. Well, I don't know, I could do something with that. I got like three of them. Uh, and I got these just CD holders, but I'll probably just put movies into them. And those are Guinness, official, kind of stylish. And this I got a while ago. I forget if I ever showed you guys this, but I found this on the side of the road. Totally free. This case is, uh, it looks like a, something you put like an iMac or something in. Or not an iMac, but like a, a MacBook in. Just because it's kind of stylish and it's a little bit dirty, but you know, 
clean this up. But what it is, it's uh, it's for, I don't know, playing cards, poker and stuff. Most of these are still in the plastic, all except for the blacks. I don't know why that is. There's like three missing. But all plastic, dice is there, and cards. Oh, the cards are actually still in plastic too, but I opened them up. But yeah, that was free too, so neat little case and everything. That's a briefcase. You can bring to parties and be like, hey, let's play some poker. I see, it's a steamer. Gotcha. Oh, that'll be real handy. Another free pile. My goodness. That's some gardening stuff. That's kind of goofy. Whatever it is. Don't know what that is. Don't know what that is. Get a quarter. A whole pile of vinyl. Sweet. So I was just at that little free pile there, and uh, yeah, there's there a bunch of other people there. So I didn't really talk too much to the camera. But there was that record player and just a shitload of records, and I got some old pictures. Nice and rustic. Gotta clean these up and hang those around. That one's kind of cool. And then I just grabbed this old book of, um, I don't know what this is. RCA Victor Company Limited. It looks very old. I thought I would just grab these as kind of decorations. There was a whole whack of vinyl out there. Probably a couple hundred records at least. And Mexicali Rose. I have no idea who any of these artists are because these are probably all from like the 50s. But what the hell? Good decoration or whatever. Just cool to have. An old picture. There's another old picture or something. West Side Well, 1957. Huh. And I got this, which looks like a... Some sort of alcohol burning torch or something? I don't know, I figured I could just clean this up and put it up there with my rustic stuff. Huh. Nice little score. Sure it would be nice if I could actually play these damn things. But we got no vinyl, no record player here. I'm gonna have to wait, I can probably find one. Easy enough, but yeah, these are like heavy. They got some weight to them. They're good. And this shit stinks, man. Whoa, old. Peggy Miller and Stu Davis, The Fate of the Flying Enterprise. Alright, so this one's about Star Trek Enterprise and by Carl Olson and the Phantom Waltz. Oh, the dust, I should be wearing a fucking mask for this. I am gonna wear a mask. Holy shit. Non breakable. Alright, so they gave a promise this is non breakable. I might have to test your theory that this uh, record is non breakable. Even though it might be a good album, you never know. Gotta love just old styling. So there you go. Now I'm back to the free pile. Looks like the record player and everything's gone, but I'm gonna go see if there's any more records. Yeah, you know, some old, old and goldies. Roger Williams, eh? Neil Diamond. I'm looking for the old stuff. Look at that. There's a crab net out there. At least it looks like a crab net. Uh, it should work for crab. If that's not for crab, uh, let me know. And I got some garden tools and some more uh, old records. Oh, lots of new goodies. I got this monitor too. It's a 24 inch Asus and 1080p. So kind of, you know, 1080p not the best for 24 inch. I think it's actually a little bit bigger than 24. Because that's supposed to be a 22, I believe. And that's... Guess it's that time of the year again. Oh, dink. Where's that doggy? Hey, buddy. He's chilling. <laughs> this again. Oh, no. Alright, guys, thanks for watching, and keep watching, keep rocking, keep rolling, and all that cool stuff. Goodbye.